mine here. Uh, I'm gonna be just a hair closer. I think you got me. Oh, looks really good, folks. Fly that bunker. You're good. We're in town for the Valero Texas Open. We heard this is where the original Texas Open took yep. place. Just tell us a little bit about this spot. 1922. This is a tilling house design uh, built in 1916. And uh, this was the home of the first Valero Texas Open. Actually, at that time, it was just a Texas Open. Uh, won by Bill McDonald. We also heard there's the Texas Golf Hall of Fame here. So yeah. it definitely sounds like there's some rich history on the game of golf. We'd love to go check it out. Yeah, the Walk of Fame is right over here. You can go Great. take a look. Let's Sweet, let's go check it out. Nice, they got Vernon here. Oh, Vern. Who else is in the Texas Golf Hall of Fame? Ben Hogan, Ben Crenshaw, Jimmy DeMerit, Jimmy Walker. Uh, Jimmy Walker was inducted in uh, 2019. Jimmy came out here and went eight under on the front nine. <laughs> this course is, it's lost its touch. It's, it's pretty short. Pros nowadays would, would eat this place up. Maybe give us a fun fact or two about some of the, you know, buildings or, you know, places around here. Well, an uh, interesting one is this building that's here right behind you. In the 1920s, a fellow by the name of Gutzon Borglum came out and he was commissioned to do something for the Texas Rangers. He liked it so much that he stayed out here and he designed Mount Rushmore right in there. No way. Very unusual, totally disconnected to golf from golf, uh, <laughs> but it's a fun fact nonetheless. Mount Rushmore. 